Hi guys, you're back with Coach Marissa from Ultimate MMA Plus. Today, today I'm going to show you guys five exercise pairings with a weighted plate for a full body workout. So the last few weeks I've showed you guys some upper body exercises, some lower body exercises. Today we're going to pair some exercises together so you can target everything. Okay, so first one we're going to do, and I'll show you from front and side. Um, so we're just going to hold this plate up top. My feet are spread out. I'm going to go squat to a deadlift. So I'm going to squat first. So shoulders are back and down. I'm keeping this plate close to me. So squat, sit those hips back. Then I'm going to turn this over so my thumbs are down. I'm going to keep my hips high. Again, I'll show you from the side. Tiny bend in my knees. I can keep my feet right where they are. Turn my toes a little bit forward. Keep my back flat. And then I'm going to let my hamstrings pull me up. Okay, so then I'll flip it back up. So one squat, drop those hips down. Flip the plate down, keep your hips high. One deadlift. So I'm looking down, my back is totally flat here. There's a tiny bend in my knees, and then I let my hamstrings pull me back up. So again, one squat, stand all the way back up, flip it over, keep the plate very close to you. One deadlift. Back up, one squat, flip it back over, one deadlift. So we're going quads and hamstrings and glutes. Okay, so we're hitting the front and back of your legs in this combo exercise. We're going to go for 10 of those, so one squat, one deadlift is one. Okay, the next one we're going to do is a floor chest press to a pullover. Okay, so we're going to be here, we can go on floor or bench. Okay, if I'm on the ground, my legs are bent up. I'm going to press this plate up. Once it's up, I'm going to drop it back overhead and then pull the weight back center. Okay, I'm going to bring my shoulder blades back and down. So press up, overhead, we can touch it down and then bring it right back center. Press up, pull it over, bring it right back center. Okay, so each one press to pull over, that's gonna be a one. Again, we're shooting for 10 of all of these exercises. Next one we're gonna do is a lunge with a twist. Okay, you can step forward, you can step back to so reverse lunge. I think a reverse lunge is safe so that we make sure our, we can see our front toes. Okay, so I'm gonna start together, I'm just holding a plate in the center, step back, let my back knee bend, I'm going to twist towards the leg that's forward. Bring it back together. If I want to do walking lunges, that's fine. Okay, so same deal. I'd step forward, just make sure you can see those front toes. Twist over that front leg, come back together. Step forward, let your back knee bend, twist over that front leg. Okay, so we're using our core as well with this. If I want to stay stationary in place, maybe you don't have a lot of room, just step back, let your back knee bend, twist towards that front leg. You're going to alternate. Step back, let that back knee bend. Good posture here. And then twist towards that leg that's forward. And we're going to go 10 of these, so that, that one's alternating. Step back to that lunge and twist. Next one we're going to do is a back row to a good morning. So I'll show you from the side. So I'm going to have my feet just about hip width. Okay, a tiny bit wider if you'd like them. That's perfectly fine. You're going to hinge at your hips, tiny bend in your knees, because we need this back in this good flat position. Okay, you're going to go back row, so I bring my elbows up, squeeze my shoulder blades together. From here, I'm using just that hinge at my hips to bring myself back up and center. I want to tuck my ribs down and squeeze my hips forward. Okay, so then we'll hinge back into that position. Our back's nice and flat here. I'll let the plate come down, so I'm going to row first and then go to my good morning. Okay, so we're going upper back and lower back in this combo. Hinge back down, weight comes back down. Row to that good morning. Hinge back down. The whole time you have to make sure your back is in that safe, good position, especially if you have a heavy plate. So all the way down, row it up, keep it tight to your body, come back up. There's always a tiny bend in your knees and you're hinging at your hips for both positions. Down, row up, hinge, good morning. So squeeze everything at the top. You're trying to straighten out nice and tall. Bring your hips forward, bring your ribs down. Okay, so again, that combo, one row. One good morning is one. We're gonna go for 10 of those. Next one is gonna challenge your grip strength depending on how heavy the plate you have. This one's a lighter plate, okay? But if I start grabbing 25 plate and more for guys, whatever, it's gonna challenge your grip strength just to grab it, okay? You're not grabbing in the center hole, okay? You're literally just gonna pinch and squeeze. At the same time, I'm gonna use my core as well. I'm gonna march. So this is gonna be for time. So you're gonna get a timer. I'm trying not to lean, let it take you over. Okay, core nice and tight. We are marching. We're gonna go 30 seconds. Once I do that 30 seconds, I'm gonna switch hands. Again, core nice and tight, shoulders back and down, good posture. So be conscious of what you're doing. We're squeezing that plate. 
both sides. My free hand is off to the side. Okay, and bring that knee up. Keep that core nice and tight. So this one is 30 seconds each. We can do anywhere from one to six sets of these. Okay, we're keeping our number at 10, but we're doubling up each exercise. So I'll run through them again. So first one is our squat. So sit those hips back, flip this plate down to our deadlift. So our hamstrings pull us up, bring it back up, squat. You can keep your feet right here for that deadlift. Keep that plate nice and close to you. One more from the side, squat, keep those hips high, back nice and flat, deadlift, squat, hips drop down, deadlift, hips stay high, but tiny bend in those knees, nice flat back. Okay, next one, we're on the ground. We're going our chest press. So floor chest press, once it's up top, my arms are locked out, bring it overhead, and then bring it back center for that pullover. So press up, overhead, back center. Press up, overhead, back center, bring those shoulders back and down, okay? Next one is our lunge with our twist. So if I wanna stay stationary, I'll step back, let that back knee bend, twist towards the leg that's forward, come back together, there's no rush here. Sit into this lunge, make sure you have good posture, twist towards the leg that's forward, and come back together. So reverse lunge or walking lunge if I go forward, but let your back knee bend so you can see those front toes, twist, come back together, other leg will step forward. Okay, so again, our number we're shooting for is 10 of each. Next one is our back row to a good morning. So hinging at your hips, nice flat back here. Bring that plate to you, squeeze your shoulder blades together. Let your hamstrings pull you up to stand up nice and tall. So hinge back down, let the weight come back down. Row up, hamstrings pull you back up. Hinge back down, weight comes down. Plate to your body, hamstrings pull you back up. Okay, so we're using our upper back and our lower back with that one in our combo exercise. The last one is our lateral, lateral carry with our march. So again, grip strength, core strength. We're squeezing this plate, core nice and tight. Make sure you guys are focused, good posture, core nice and tight. A little bit of weight will challenge you. Okay, these are for our obliques. Okay, we wanna tighten up those sides and the front. Okay, because we this plate wants to pull us and we're gonna keep ourselves centered. Then we'll switch after 30 seconds. Okay, good posture, core nice and tight. All right, so again, anywhere if one full round of this, you know, makes you guys <laughs> totally tired, you stop at one, maybe next time do two. So anywhere from one to six sets. Hopefully you guys like this. I will write the full workout in the description below. If you guys have any questions, definitely leave me a comment below. If you guys like this, um, definitely give me a thumbs up so I know. And if you never want to miss another workout, definitely subscribe to our channel, Ultimate MMA Plus. See you guys next time.